shaker and let's get started so stand up with me and sing I've got mine right here today I put a little something different in it I put some peppercorns in now peppercorns are what you make black pepper out of sometimes you may have these at home too I'll open this container to show you they're little tiny black round pieces and you can put them in a pepper grinder and that's what makes black pepper to season your food. So I've got peppercorns. The sound is a little bit softer of a shake than some of the other things I've used like the rice or the popcorn. It's a little bit um, softer sound. Still shakes but a little bit different. So let's sing together shall we? Here we go. Ready? Hello, 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 I'm very glad to say Hello, 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 it's music time today Hello, 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 I'm very glad to say Hello, 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 it's music time today One, two, one, two, three Hello everybody, yes indeed, yes indeed, yes indeed Let's make music, yes indeed, yes indeed, my friends. Hello everybody, yes indeed, yes indeed, yes indeed. Let's make music, yes indeed, yes indeed, my friends. Hello boys and girls. Hello boys and girls. Hello boys and girls. So good to see you today. By the way, who can tell me what this instrument is called? It has a metal body. However, unlike the trumpet, which has valves that you push down and a mouthpiece that you buzz on, right? This has a mouthpiece with a reed on it. Hmm. It also has keys and holes. So the keys and the holes and the mouthpiece tell us that it is a woodwind instrument. Even though it's a metal body, specifically brass, this is a member of the woodwind family and this is an alto saxophone. So. If you said alto saxophone, you are correct. Uh, it is one of the instruments that you can select when you get to sixth grade. If you sign up for band, this is one of the instruments that you will be able to play. So that is my little presentation on the instrument I'm playing. I'm gonna play something else. See if you can guess this mystery melody.
Think you know it? What's your guess? I will give you the answer a little bit later in this lesson. Second grade music, friends. What's that sound? Second grade music, friends. I know what it is. It's Mozart Mouse. I'm here, music friends. Good to see you. How are you, Mozart Mouse? I'm great, and I'm excited to see my second grade friends. Music friends, stand up. Stand up so we can sing and warm up our voices. Here we go. Music friends. One, two, three. Do, me, do. Do, me, fa. Fa, so, so. So, la, me. Mi, re, do. Faster. Do, do, re. Do, 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 re. Re, mi, mi. Re, mi, so. So, la, so. So, do, do. Air high five. Great job. Good to see you. We'll say goodbye to Mozart Mouse. Bye, music friends. We'll see him next week. Okay, next thing to do, we have Nano Mouse here. We're going to see what she has for us today. I think she's got some music symbols. Let's take a look. Hello there, music friends. Hi, Nano Mouse. What do we have today? Oh, okay. Music friends, repeat it to me. Half note, half note, two beats of sound, two beats of sound. One, two, one, two. And you should clap though, so that'll help you. Let's go to the next one. Music friends, half rest, half rest. Two beats of silence, two beats of silence. Music friends, whole note, whole note, four beats of sound, four beats of sound. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Music friends, whole rest, whole rest. Four beats of silence, four beats of silence. Music friends, dotted half note, dotted half note. Three beats of sound, three beats of sound. One, two, three. One, two, three. Music friends, four, four time signature. Four, four time signature. Four beats of sound. Four beats in a measure. Let's say that again. Four beats in a measure. The bottom four means the quarter note gets one beat. The quarter note gets one beat. And this whole thing is called a time signature. We'll study those more as third graders, but you're almost there already. We're back to half note. Let's take a look. She's got a couple more down here. Music friends, we have eighth note. See the little flag on it? Eighth note, that's half beat of sound. And here we have an eighth rest. That's half beat of silence. We have two eighth notes. Each one is half beat of sound. And you go one and, one and. And then we have dotted half rest. Dotted half rest, that's three beats of silence. So you go, one, two, three. So there you have it. Eighth note, eighth rest, two eighth notes, dotted half rest. Let's say goodbye to Nano Mouse. Music friends. Oh, I hear something else. Who could that be? Me. 
music, friends. It's Beethoven Bear. Well, hi there, Beethoven. What do we have today? I've got some rhythms for the children. Let's check them out. Music friends, grab your shakers. And I, by the way, if you have some of Ms. Dimmick's fun kitchen instruments, now's the time to go grab one. All those great things that she told us to use as instruments in the kitchen, I want you to pause the video and go grab one of those right now. And we'll play those rhythms, these rhythms with those instruments. Go ahead. Okay, got the instrument. We've got our rhythms and Beethoven Bear, here we go. We'll do each one twice so you get a chance to do it. And if you make a mistake, that's okay. You'll learn from it and we do it again. Here we go. It's in three, three beats in each measure. So we'll count to three, Mr. Benson will, and we'll start after that. Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Do it again, ready? Here we go. One, two, three. One, two, three. That's it. Let's go to the next one. Here we go. Music friends, ready, two, and here we go. One, two, and three, four. Again, ready, here we go. One, two, and three, four. That's it, fantastic. Next one. Oh, we can do this. One, two, and ready, go. One, two, three, and four. Again, ready, here we go. One, two, three, and four. Next one. Ready, two, and here we go. One, two, and three, four. Again, ready, here we go. One, two, and three, four. Next one. One, two, ready, and go. One, two, three, and four. Again, ready, and here we go. One, two, three, and four. You got it. One and two and ready, go. One and two and three, four again. Ready, here we go. One and two and three, four. Music friends, high fives. Fantastic job with the rhythms and the cymbals and the singing. Let's go on. Last time we learned Skip to My Lou, we did verse one, which is uh, little red wagon painted blue. And then we learned verse two, ride to the dance with Uncle Hugh. Today we're gonna learn verse three. Sorry, as I turn my paper. We're going to do verse three today, which is, uh, Papa's gonna ride his one-eyed mule. Papa's gonna ride his one-eyed mule. Papa's gonna ride his one-eyed mule. Skip to my mule, my darling. So, kind of a silly verse. Papa's gonna ride his one-eyed mule. So just cover your eye. Here we go. One, two, here we go. Papa's gonna ride his one-eyed mule. Papa's gonna ride his one-eyed mule. Papa's gonna ride his one-eyed mule. Skip to my loo, my darling. Loo, loo. Skip to my loo. Loo, loo. Skip to my loo. Loo, loo. Skip to my loo. Skip to my loo, my darling. Verse two. Ride to the dance. Ready and go. Ride to the dance with Uncle Hugh. Ride to the dance with Uncle Hugh. Ride to the dance with Uncle Hugh. Skip to my loo, my darling. Loo, loo. Skip to my loo. Lulu, skip to my loo, Lulu, skip to my loo, skip to my loo, my darling. Verse one, ready, two, here we go. Little red wagon painted blue, little red wagon painted blue, little red wagon painted blue, skip to my loo, my darling. Lulu, skip to my loo, Lulu, skip to my loo, Lulu, skip to my loo, skip to my loo, my darling. There you go, music friends. Next is our mystery melody. Can you guess what Mr. Benson played for you on the 
alto saxophone, a member of the woodwind family because of the mouthpiece with the reed on it and the keys and the holes. It's a member of the woodwind family. What was the melody that I played for you today? If you guessed Super Mario Brothers theme, you are correct. Now, we're gonna play a little freeze dance. So I want you moving around as I play it again. When I get to places where I stop playing, the rests, right? When I get to rests, you need to freeze. And then when I start playing, then unfreeze and start dancing. Here we go. Moving up, get stand up and move around. Here we go. One, two, ready and go. <laughs> Fantastic music, friends. I'm so, so happy. You did a great job. Okay, so what did we do today? We did our hello songs. We identified the saxophone, a member of the Woodwind family. By the way, this is something that you can play when you get to sixth grade and seventh grade and eighth grade band. If you sign up for band, this is one of the instruments in the band. We did solfege with Mozart Mouse. We did cymbals with Nanaro Mouse, his sister. We did rhythms on our kitchen instruments that Miss Dimmick told us about with Beethoven Bear. We sang Skip to My Lou and we learned verse three. We did the motions. And lastly, we discovered the mystery melody, Super Mario Brothers theme, and we danced it in a freeze dance style while Mr. Benson played the alto saxophone. Music friends in second grade, it was so great to see you today. I hope you have a wonderful week and you stay healthy and safe. I miss you all and I look forward to seeing you very soon. I might even see some of you this week as I'm Zooming with my second grade friends this week in some of the classrooms. So music friends, until next time, stay safe and have a musical day. Let's say goodbye everybody. Ready? Goodbye, everybody. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Let's make music. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed, my friends. Goodbye, boys and girls. We'll see you next time, music friends. Bye, second graders.